Tick tock. What's up? We are Wrestling Maniacs. It's Friday Night Smackdown. We got some reactions today because I knew Smackdown is going to be freaking really good. WWE is finally being great again. And freaking, of course, Rampage. I'm going to try to do some as well because they got a lot of promos and stuff. Chaos. Tends to present itself. Last week, that is exactly what happened. The rebirth of a darkened soul. <laughs> Drew McIntyre, Roman Reigns, the chosen ones. Must be nice. Us. Cast out of paradise, disregarded like a broken toy, to be forgotten. But we never forgot. We prepared, and we waited for the perfect time to strike with vengeance. Everybody knows about the bloodline. Now, now we're going to show them the new timeline. Oh, no! No matter where the time is told, in the end, everybody pays the toll. TikTok. TikTok! He's back, baby! Let's go! And he's already stalking his prey! What? Dude! This is how he should have been booked to begin with! Oh my god, the fact that he's gonna be like the second top heel in SmackDown. I freaking love it. And we got Drew McIntyre here. Hopefully at Clash at the Castle, this man wins the championship. And we can get him versus Karrion Cross for like Survivor Series or something. Because I really would love Karrion Cross to be a world champion. Maybe not right away, but we need to get this man a world championship. Wow! Kyrian Cross and Scar, I love it. I freaking love the whole Kyrian Cross thing. And especially how they did that shot with him looking like at Drew McIntyre as he's getting ready to come out. Fucking beautiful execution right there. Oh, Drew McIntyre's about to cut a promo. This could be about last week with Killer Cross. Oh boy. I love the freedom that these wrestlers got with Triple H being in charge. Like, it doesn't feel like they're talking like robots. And I swear, this is the perfect time for McIntyre to win the championship back. It's going to be in the UK. This is the perfect opportunity. And he needs to come back to Broken Dreams, all right? I want Broken Dreams, McIntyre. let me hear you Ooh, where do I begin? It's an exciting time in WWE. There's a lot of new faces showing up. In fact, let's start right there. New faces. Drew McIntyre was jumped from behind by Karrion Cross last week. I loved it. <laughs> and a lot of people probably think I'm going to rant and rave and talk about the horrible things I plan to do to him. I do. But I get it. I understand the man's been waiting for an opportunity. He's been waiting for a year. And what bigger impact than attacking the number one contender and staring down the undisputed champion? I like this. It's putting him over. Here's the problem. That number one contender you left like a piece of trash is Drew McIntyre. And he was going to get back up and deliver this message to you. My hands are a little full right now, buddy. But when the time is right, we're going to play a little game. It's going to be multiple choice. I'm going to give you three options. <laughs> One, knockout. Two, the hospital. Or 
play more? The graveyard. And I will send you back to that dungeon you crawled out of. <laughs> Let's go! Also, I suggest you check out Drew McIntyre, Roman Reigns, at Clash of the Castle. Everybody, I'm about to break some bad news. It's shocking news. Roman Reigns is not here tonight. Ah, come on. Of course he's not. He's a part-timer. Roman's not at work. I'm sure someone will pass you this message, Roman. I'm going to be honest with you. Since you surround yourself with yes, man, you started believing your own hype, and you're as good as you say you are, but here's the reality. The last two matches were Brock Lesnar. It took you, your family, weapons, sacrificing the wise man to get the job done against Brock Lesnar. But Drew McIntyre, the man you're facing, walked into the main event of WrestleMania with Brock, and I beat him with my bare hands. And that fucking Claymore kick. He Claymore kicked him into a cowboy. You're making up places. The island of relevancy is not a real place. Oh, yeah! TikTok! Oh, that entrance. Oh, I love it. Oh my god. That ladies and gentlemen is Scarlet. The black and white. I love it. Not sure I know what any of that means, but I do know. This is how they should have been booked! To be felt here in thank you, Triple H! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Oh, it's the bloodline. Oh, come on, Karrion. Karrion Cross is teasing me. I do got pointed out here. Jay is better than Jimmy. He came out while it was black and white and brought it in the color real quick. Drew, it's Drew now fighting back. There we go, McIntyre. Ah, oh, he got super kicked. This is what happens when you get a chance to dance with the Damn, I was so excited for carrying cross. Damn. McIntyre has it coming from both sides. Oh please. Please have Cross beat their asses, please. Come on. Ah! They want you to wait. This is how you know Triple H knows how to freaking create, all right? Because he... <laughs> they got me wanting freaking Gary across to kick their asses.